Okay, uh, this is May 5th, period 7. Today we are doing transformations of trigonometric functions, and today we're doing all of the transformations that rely on a multiplier A. Um, everybody in this class has been informed that they are being recorded. Hey. Shout out goes Here to Otis seven. and to Maria. Period 7, make some noise. Woo!
minimums are at positive one, and the minimums are at negative one. I'm going to connect them in a smooth sinusoidal curve. For the posterity that viewed this video years and years from now, in the year 2014, it was really cool to say, What you coming at my neck? I didn't say that. No, you coming at my neck. Looks good. I mean, when you look at it, that's, <laughs> yeah. not, that's not the worst development of our society in this age. So you want to look at it like that. Why are you coming down my neck for? All right, what's zero times two? Zero. What is one times two? Two. One. one. <laughs> what is zero times two? Zero. What is negative one times two? Negative two. Two. What is zero times two? Zero. <laughs> this is true. Really. What is negative one times two? Negative two. Zero times two? Zero. Oh. Positive one times two? Two. And zero one. times two? Zero. So what does this green line represent? So what does this green line represent? This is the vertical stretch of a multiple two of the sine curve. So this problem is done. She got dropped.